The lockdown in Shanghai hasn't significantly affected Singapore's supplies. This, this assurance came from Minister of State for Trade and Industry, Lo Yenling, who was responding to MPs worried about the global supply chain crunch. And she says that Singapore's reliance on China for items like essential food and healthcare items is low. It also imports food supplies from other Chinese cities, which aren't classified as high risk for now. Meantime, manufacturing and construction firms are coping with shipment delays, even when they rely on China for many materials, such as electronics, machinery and metals. As a buffer from these shocks, the government will continue diversifying its imports and producing locally. Nonetheless, as the lockdowns in China have further strained global supply chains, which are already under stress due to the Russia-Ukraine conflict, they are likely to exacerbate global inflationary pressures in the near term. How the effects play out over the longer term will depend on the scale and the extent of the lockdowns and their impact on China's economy.